Recently, President-elect Donald Trump made a strategic shift in his cabinet nominations after Matt Gallitz, his original pick for attorney general, stepped aside. Gallitz's candidacy became mired in controversy due to ongoing scrutiny over a federal sex trafficking investigation, casting doubt on his ability to be confirmed by the Senate. This led Trump to pivot quickly, announcing that he would nominate former Florida Attorney General Pam Bondi for the position instead. Bondi who has long been a staunch ally of Trump, was a vocal defender during his first impeachment trial, where Trump faced allegations of abusing his power related to Ukraine. She was also present to support Trump during his criminal trial over hush money payments, which ended in a conviction. With years of legal experience, Bondi brings a more established legal background compared to Gavayets whose limited experience and legal troubles made his confirmation a challenging prospect. Trump expressed gratitude for Gavarence's efforts, but acknowledged that the distractions surrounding him were not conducive to the smooth functioning of his transition. Bondi's selection as attorney general signals Trump's continued reliance on loyal figures to help implement his agenda. She has been a vocal critic of the Justice Department's investigations into Trump, particularly those led by special counsel Jack Smith. Her position within the Republican Party has been solidified by her leadership at the America First Policy Institute, a think tank established by former Trump administration staffers. As attorney general, Bondi would oversee a Justice Department that is expected to shift its focus under Trump's leadership. The incoming administration is likely to take a more aggressive stance on civil rights, corporate enforcement, and the prosecution of those involved in the January 6th Capitol riots. Trump's promise to pardon many of his supporters involved in the riots adds another layer of complexity to the role Bondi will assume. While some Republican figures, including Senator Lindsey Graham, have praised Bondi's appointment, calling it a grand slam pick, the confirmation process will not be without scrutiny. The Senate, led by Republicans, is expected to confirm Bondi swiftly, though questions remain about how her tenure will shape the future of the Department of Justice. Bondi's rise also marks the latest example of Trump's unorthodox approach to staffing his administration, which continues to be marked by fast-paced and sometimes controversial decisions. Stay subscribed for more videos.